turn the tides around into their favor. Fisker trying to find an opening kill. Doesn't manage to find too much. In fact, he's going to be tagged down at 46 HP. Well, everybody else on the side of yeah. Team Secrets able to successfully pull back onto the A site and stay safe. Going to have one tucked away just at the top of the sewer left. access. Fisker rushing forward. Jesse Bash going to fall. Nice shots there from Munchkin. Fisker comes up with two. Gets dubstep, follows up for wits. Just Spike like that. It certainly are shifting. Crazy Raccoon with five members strong. So going to hold off Gorkum and Dispenser now. See if they can get anything done. Yeah, this is good utilization of the utility to buy time here. And the Asker smokes with the, the Breach utility. Just keep it going. Nat's going to lock it down. Munchkin finishes the job. A flawless. Drone coming through. Get the dart into him. Lines now coming through. Fisker again getting his entry. Spots just sprays away with the Spectre. Then just to come up with a kill, but it's going to be two on the return. Just finding one. Spencer moves in with a frenzy. Finds another. Borkum puts Ade down. He's got a martial in hand. It's only loaded with one bullet right now. He's going to take his time. Put a couple more in. Shifts over. Grabs the Spectre. Gets himself situated. It seems like Neth is very well aware of his position. And there's the Nebula coming up. He rotates to the side, and Bork comes ready on the jump. It's out of the map, but it seems like they might just stick. Look at what Jesse Bash did. Kill. Look at, they, they, you know, you, if you're Crazy Raccoon, had they gone over to C. They're getting so much info. Yeah, they they might have suspected o Oh, goes for the push, but it's just good for the kill. But as he tries to rotate back, we get that bot set up on top. Dispenser says, nope. Flips him in the skull. Jesse Bash, however, does fall. That means that the C site is unoccupied. Black point out on the corner. Shots coming in. Wit's going to be good for one. Falls down 45 HP. Splash goes out. Looks for a target. Doesn't see anybody. Needs to try to clear that cubby. Nebula in the back. Dispenser's got just enough vision to spot one. Gets Ade. Puts a little bit of damage out. And that is going to be the lockdown. Now available. Throws it back corner. Little sliver of space for Munchkin to tuck away in. The Rolling Thunder is going to be used as Nebula pushes nice. into the garage. Gets Dispenser. Now it's Wit's all on his lonesome. Tries to move out. Yeah. Right, well, operator, oh, made known. Dubstep goes for the repick. A bit of a bold move there. Manages to make it out to safety. Let's get knocked down to 84 HP, however. This has got to go well. Fisker dashing forward, spots one. Cloudburst to try to cover. Fisker going to take a little bit of damage from Munchkin's shock dart. Tucked away over in short. Jesse Bash comes up with two. He's looking for a bit more. Can't quite get a third. Does end up falling. Fisker going to be good for one, but Wits and Borkum have arrived. With the help of Dispenser, they will mow. But not much. You'll have one Nano Swarm from Medusa. You know, the Astra stuff is still there, but losing Munchkin takes away a lot of your ability to gain information. So you're going to have to make it work off some pretty wild and stuff. There's that turret again in Garage Door. We saw it previously comboed with the Gravity. Well, there's a Nano Swarm on the other side. Yep. Start pushing their way in. Nano Swarm yep. comes 30 out. Seconds left. Trying to get the catch with the fault line as well. Slows them up for just a little bit, but now they need to push in. They're running out of time. 20 seconds remaining. Medusa makes his way forward. It's just on the outskirts of the gravity well. Bit of a daze out on to Borkum, but as that dissipates, he manages to find a kill. Two quick ones from Dispenser. And they can finally utilize it. themselves in onto a site. Right there. And be able to defend the spike from there. Yep, good, good, good. Good recognition. This is what I'm talking about. They found a way to break down this setup. They get rid of the Nano Swarm and the turret. They get the information that they're on there. They're able to ping it, shoot it down, clean it out. Now the garage is open, and now they have to respect that. Okay. Cutting across the side. Support position from Jesse Fosh. Manages to find one, but Munchkin replies oh, in kind with a nice little headshot. Rolling Thunder now going to be used. Only catches one. It's going to be Wits playing back inside of the link. Upsip still sticking around in sewer. Managed to find that elimination onto Medusa. Now they don't have that lockdown to try to utilize here in the round. Days is coming out. Ade moving forward. We'll find one. Upsip and Wits both going to go down. Spencer comes up with another. Lockdown looks to flush them out of the site. Spike not planted. Looks like they're just going to go ahead, go on a walkabout, and over to either B or C. Yeah, Munchkin caught in no man's land in that smoke right by the link, but they're able to rotate. Because of this defender's lockdown. Left. And now the garage is clear. They're able to get through that easy. That gives them a little extra time. Now there are the stars here. That gravity well is going to drag Neth off by themselves sometime. Try to delay this plant a little bit longer. Get into position. Look at this flank from Dispenser. Oh, spots him in the astral form. Ganade just doesn't have enough time to try to really stabilize and understand what's going on. It's struck down and now the rough tidings for Neth. Manages to find one. Got the fault line out onto Dispenser. Turn comes down, he's looking for the kill, but Dispenser 
Strikes him down. Three kills in the round as the defuse will come through. Seven to two so far in the half. Team Secret looking like they will not be denied. Opportunity countering things with the right utility at the right time. The lockdown puts Crazy Raccoon in a horrible spot and just gets swatted away. Oh, Fisker has just not been having it. A you good day run. today. Are they going to be thinking about that step? He they care. managed to trade it back. Medusa finding two. That's going to be rather huge for them. Aftershock should clear the lockdown, and it does. And Wits just putting this round on his back. Says, I'll get rid of the Killjoy utility. I'll get rid of everybody. Borkum will snatch it away from him at the very end. But man. Oh, at the beginning. That's a, that's a win every time for Dubstep. Okay, Munchkin. Oh, hell. Managed to find one. Good spray through the wall. It's the wall bang there onto the dispenser. He's been a very solid rock here for Team Secret when it comes down to clutching out these rounds. So getting him off the table, definitely a good look for them. Borkum, though, he's got an operator in the back of the site. Hunter Spear is going to come through and try to flush him out. Going to get tagged up once, manages to avoid the last one. Now Hunter Spear coming in to try to apply some extra pressure against the side of Crazy Raccoon. Borkum manages to swing wide, gets yet another pick before Fisker takes him down. Hunter Spear finds one, which will get another. And it's the last round, so why the hell not? Pops the Rolling Thunder, sees Munchkin in. Crazy Raccoon right now. Yeah, I mean, we'll see. Crazy Raccoon, they were able to get the first pistol round. Granted, it was then turned around in the second round, and Team Secret won a thrifty. The turret really turned the tide, but... <laughs> Oh, getting that first pistol would be huge. A dispenser, a little bit of a whip there at the beginning. Still manages to stabilize for one, but Fisker will trade it back. One exchange, turn away Borkum. All the crazy raccoons here. Stay alive. Yeah, they're just all piled up what into the this? garage. Team Secret already have that spike planted, and Dubstep is just shutting them out one by one. Dart goes forward, shows that somebody's waiting inside of the nebula. Four members strong versus two. Medusa and Fisker. Can they do anything at all? They've already taken a significant amount of damage as well. Just go down to about half HP. Shots flying through, and there you go. Dubstep cleans it up. There's no more of this nonsense. There was that one random spike against Gambit where they looked like they might take something off of them, Achilles, yeah. but that's it. Uh, uh, Otherwise, it's just been, you know, they beat Havan Liberty. That, that was amazing, you know, the first win internationally for Japan and Valorant, but other than that, it's just been not, that's, that's not good. Again, oh my one God. after the other, Dubstep continues to press <laughs> forward, dispensers on the back end, it's a quick tap to Medusa's skull, and just like that, we are at match, match point. point. Crazy Rack. Tournament have a strong showing, especially after what we saw against Gambit. I was just really, really hoping, but it just wasn't meant to be. They just were Where not prepared this? for this. Dart is going into the stratosphere. What in the world? This is one of the slowest starts I've ever seen. on the roof? I don't know, either way. Is it bounce? I, like, I don't even care that Neth got a kill. I'm so fascinated. Where does this land? What? what? I don't even care what's going on in the screen. It okay. landed at the corner of A, men a entrance. Okay, well, back into the action we go. Jesse Bosch has gotten a kill. Munchkin, Munchkin taken down. We have a 4v4. Workum and Neth both similar on HP levels. A little bit of a bounce there coming through. Trying to get a catch on to anybody. Does not, but Spike has been planted in Team Secret are in this to win it. Crazy Raccoon playing for the tournament lives right now. Need to run it back. 10 consecutive rounds. This would be the first step. Medusa's gonna find one. Jesse Bosch, take it out. But Dubstep throws the knives, manages to find one. Can't quite get the second. Medusa is looking to keep them in the game. He goes for the push, but Borkum lurking in hell with 20 HP. Finds the shot. They're so evenly matched as far as health is concerned. 20 versus 15. Borkum's got the hit. It's the...